Please let me out. No. Let me out, please. No. For three years, the Darling family has spent their Halloweens giving back. One evening we sat down with the children and we asked them what we can do to make a difference. And they said, well, let's give back for trick-or-treating for uh, candy. We can trick-or-treat for canned goods. Scare away hunger started after the 2007 ice storm. With no power or heat, the family relied on a local church to keep them warm and fed. Now they're going door-to-door -door collecting canned food to donate to the Community Food Bank of Eastern Oklahoma. Thank you. Uh -huh. Thank you very much. Uh -huh. Thank you. I think this is great. I mean, what a great way. You know, we're all thinking in this time of year especially, of how we can impact our community. And the goodwill is growing. Several local organizations are joining in, as well as a few football teams. Hi, my name is Jacob, and uh, we're doing a scare away for hunger this year, and we'd like to know if you'd like to donate a can. We had a competition, a friendly competition, between um, the Side Cardinals and some of the union teams to see who could collect the most canned goods. Who's doing the cans? Me. And who usually wins? East Side. <laughs> Organizers say they expect more than 50 participants this year. Usually they hesitate to wonder what we're saying until we explain it, then they usually go for the can. We have all been there at one time where we struggle with money. Um, food is one of the first things that you worry about. No child should have to worry about food. Thank you. Randy Lane, 2 News works for you.